That's what we doing, right? We just speculating, right? Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm just watching. I'm just looking. YouTube, this is Slick Talk, and I'm back with another video. So I'm hearing reports from the Sunday Times that AKA was apparently banned from Durban. I'm hearing that he was banned from Durban. He had received multiple warnings never to set foot in Durban. People had told him on multiple occasions never to set foot in Durban, and he did it anyway. He did it anyway, even though he knew he wasn't good in Durban. You were never good in Durban, AKA. You were never free to roam the streets of Durban because they still haven't forgiven you for what you did to the, to the, to the sunflower. You think people forgot about Nelly Tembe? Is that what you think? You think people have forgotten what happened to Nelly Tembe, AKA, rest in peace, my brother, but life does not work like that. People don't just move on in the blink of an eye. People don't just move on. That's not how life works. You have to be careful and you have to move accordingly. This is what I was trying to tell people. You have to move accordingly. If you're banned from a certain place, how dare you? The ignorance and the naive, naivete of posting locations showing people where you are the whole fucking weekend. Life does not work like that. You have to be cautious at all times. You have to move accordingly at all times because you're not home. You're not home. You're in Durban, my G. You're in Durban. Posting your locations, posting your the barbershop, you're posting the restaurant. Life does not work like that. AKA was careless with his movement. Let's call a spade a spade. AKA was careless with his movement. I love the guy's music and I like his personality. But at the end of the day. So I was saying yesterday, right? When you go back to the video, right? You see the security guards, they open the door. Mm -hmm. In my head, right? If I'm an artist, like I said yesterday, we not really chilling outside. Not on the main street. We might chill in the back. Yeah, no, yeah. We we hopping right into yeah, the car. We out. We chilling in the back. Well, you know, like, you know, but we're chilling at this table. We're not chilling yeah, outside yeah, in the front where everybody could see us and we open like that. We're getting right in the car and we out of here. Yeah. We're moving quickly. We're moving smart. we tapped with it. So I understand what he's saying like that, too, because I do agree. Like, why are you, why you, you giving? In, you in the ops. I'm giving um, this you, man a. a and you basically just. The ops already told you don't pull up here, bro. This, the, the, ops already, the ops already told you don't pull up over here. And then that hug is too long for me. No, I fuck with I fuck with everybody, but that that hug, no, that no. hug too long for me. I'm dapping you up and I'm out. I'm dapping you up inside. Or if I'm hugging you that long, I'm hugging you inside. I know, like we would, I was, all I know is we would have jumped straight in the V. And we out. We move it. We not. We, I'm not trying to be seen. We would have been dapping each other up. And but then again, then again, if it was a supposed hit, they was trying to hit him. They was trying to shoot the nigga from the car. He was supposed to get in the car, and so then he was supposed to shoot him that way. That's why the nigga was standing behind the, the whip. That's why the nigga was standing, and that's why the nigga was standing over there. And it makes sense. That's why the nigga standing by the whip. So he wouldn't even let him get in the whip. That's why the nigga standing by the whip. He wouldn't even let him get in the whip. That's, what, that's basically what you're saying. Like they not even like at this time, no, right? They gonna let him get in the whip. Mm -hmm. As soon as he get in the whip, it's they over. Shoot. So you saying regardless? You saying, regardless, saying regardless? He's not getting away. From 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 I'm just that's asking. that's what from could, what it looks like yeah that's what it could be that soon as because boom they come out uh huh first thing the nigga do is open the door because even if he did have a chance to get to the car you are saying the first shooters right there no, 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 the no I'm saying they was trying to, they what I seen in the last video what the last dude was talking about the mm -hmm. NATO NATO what's that's his name right we gonna watch that next I'm sorry say that again you heard it that that was his name right NATO NATO not NATO, yeah, okay. Yeah. He said that they was trying to ambush him and shoot him in the car. No. From the back of the car. Okay, they was, trying to, that. they was trying to make him get in first, put him on, like, the, the outside window. That's why the shooter's right there. That's why I kind of make... It don't make sense because I ain't no investigator, but I'm just using my skills, my, my witty skills. Mm -hmm. Uh, What you call it? That's why he's standing at the car. That's why the other shooter is behind the car. Because if, if that's the case, they could have rushed him outside as soon as he came out the door. What was the point of, you feel me? The plot is sitting right there. So you, think the, he, so you think the plan was probably to hit him inside the car? Yeah, you can't go nowhere. You in the car. You but since he was outside for so long, yeah, he, they were just like, fuck plans it. Plans change. Yeah. Because look, play, 
Play the video. No, wait. I gotta go to the actual video. This oh, is this do. is just us. Hold up. You got you you, you 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 got something. You got something. Hold up. I'm here with you. I'm here with you. Hold up. Sorry guys, we trying to Oh my god, fuck. I need like a link where I could just pop that bitch in. Oh my god, cause so many people talking about it. So you gotta find the there you go. Gossip. My fault, my fault, my fault. Okay, where where you want me? Where you start from the beginning? From the beginning. The beginning? Yeah. Everything pop up. All right, boom. Boom. Then, one more time, one more time. This is not me. This is just me making an accusation off of what the other guy said, NATO said. Mm -hmm. So, boom. He making a phone call, allegedly making a phone call, checking with the, checking the coast, seeing if the coast is clear, going to the first shooter. Mm Mm-hmm. Checking on the shooter. Boom. Alright. Fast forward. Boom. They come outside. First thing. That door come open. Uh. Oh, they ain't open it yet. No, it's about to open. It's about to open. Boom. Door slide back. They think he finna... He, he done did his uh, dapping up. Ah, ah, ah. I get what you're saying. He done did his dapping up. Uh-huh. He finna walk to the car. They just know he finna walk to the car. Uh-huh. Buddy posted right there. He right there. He like, oh, fuck. Nigga ain't nigga ain't come to the car, so boom. He like, and then oh, he, shit. he pop out like, oh, niggas over here. All right. I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. So look, if he, if, okay, so you see the minivan, right? When he opened the door, you know how the minivans is. It's three, three in the back. Yeah. Feel me? One, two, oh, and then one, he gonna, two. He gonna jump he right straight in the back. Cause look, oh, even, he jumping in the back. Even in the video, even in the other video we was talking about, mm-hmm. the nigga was sitting in the back seat. It was. His man sitting in the what you call it. Yeah, he was sitting all the way in the back. Recording it. He was sitting, he was in that sitting back all the way in the back. You're Niggas right. thought they was going to sit in the same You're seating right. arrangement. Uh huh. But he was going to catch him from right there. He was going to catch him from right there. Like, okay. I get what you're saying. And then make it look like niggas just shot the car up and he randomly was the only one that got hit. If that's that's just going off of what NATO said. Okay. Described. But also, NATO did say that they probably wanted to hit him outside because if they did him in the car, the bullets was going to ricochet. That's what I'm saying. That, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. He did but, say that too, so I'm just saying. Like, true, 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 true. Like, um, I, I ain't want to... Because what Not you did true, say... Though. No, but if he didn't say that or didn't say that, what you did say is a good point, though. Because they could have lined them up like that, too. Yeah, you that's ain't say nothing wrong. Like. Yeah, you ain't say nothing wrong. He could have did that shit. But it's just like... um, Because... If he if they would have shot him if the first shooter would have shot him from the street right here, right here, I got you I got you I got you uh huh I got you all right go to where he was standing across the street that's him right right Boom. white shirt if they was all in flooded in this car mm-hmm. and he shot him from right there they would have never caught him Ooh. and they would have never caught him and they would have never got this footage they would have never got I got a question I got corner. a question I got a question right he in the back seat right <laughs> this is going off your play. Homie, homie in the white shirt, right? Mm-hmm. If he, if he is in the 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 passenger seat far back, passenger side all the way in the back, right? Homie's already in the back. First shooter, second shooter, black hoodie right here. He's already in the back seat. White shirt's right here. Do you think they could have just um right? I guess so many ways you could think about this shit. Uh-huh. I'm just, I'm just saying like, look, the whole angle is yeah, this. it's the car, right? The whole angle is the car, and then now the plan switches when he sees them right here, white hoodie. He yeah, sees them. He like, side. he like, oh shit. Niggas politicking like, yeah. right, fuck it, I gotta come over here. I already probably feel me. Look, he got his hands in his pocket. Yeah, that that dap up. It's too much dap ups, hugs. It, it's too long, and then bro. Look, and then look, boom. That shit is too long for me, bro. Bro, see him. He like, has to see him, bro. The nigga who's hugging AK has to see that nigga, bro. Look, boom. He see him right there. He go back for another one. Uh, all right, he close. Oh, you're not here yet. Wait, can you pause it real quick? Did peep this video, right? I know they all talking. I know everybody talking. The security guards is right here, though. But y'all don't... People's eating right here. Nobody sees white shirt. Nobody's going to scream. Yo, bro. Nothing? Nobody sees nothing? I don't know. Ah, that's tough, bro. Cause I, ain't gonna lie. I know. I would've been on point. I'd be like, "Yo, what the fuck?" If like, you look straight, you can see from left and right, bro. You can see certain things, and certain things don't look right. It's gonna catch your attention, like, "Yo." But then again, it happens so quick too. If niggas is, if y'all outside in a public place or a lit place, and everybody just walking back and forth, you ain't gonna think that 
you know, check everybody, every no, person that this is past. my job. No, no, no. I'm talking about like I thought you were saying like the people were just sitting down and shit. Oh yeah, yeah. People sitting yeah. down is cool, but look. Okay, so one, two, three, right? You see one, two, three. Those might be his friends. The one in front, that's security. He's supposed to be. Remember, this video started with all three. Hold on, look, look. One, two, three. You supposed your eyes are supposed to be right here. Yeah. On homie. Ah, he chilling. Look, uh, yo, we out of here. Uh, bullshitting, bro. That's not your job. Your job is to protect this man, bro. Feel me? If if these two people's on the hit, cool. Feel me? They. Cool, but if you not on the hit, stick to your job because now you look like, yeah, let me let me, I'm out of here. Let me, yeah, should look crazy, bro. And then black shirt, I don't know, that hug is a little suspect. That's all I'm gonna say. That's crazy, though. But hold on, back to um, Silky, let's get it. We have to learn from his mistakes so we don't repeat them. You don't go to a place that you're not welcome and think you're the king and be walking around during at night thinking you're the man. Life does not work like that. You have to move accordingly. If you go to a place that you're not familiar with, SA is your country, we get it. But you're not from Durban. You don't know how people move in Durban. And the way you did it, you were careless. You were irresponsible. You, you... You're partly to blame for this because you didn't take the necessary precautions. Let me tell you something. When I was invited to go to Mac G's podcast, he invited me to go. Let me tell you that the time that I was supposed to go, I didn't go. You know why? Because I thought it was a setup and I thought something was going to happen. So what I did was I used a little bit of a trick. I didn't go and then I wanted to see his reaction. If he had an angry reaction on some like, why didn't you come? I gave you an opportunity. Why didn't you come? Then I would have knew from that moment on that it was a setup and I did the right thing by not going. So what I did was I didn't go and I wanted to see his reaction. But when his reaction was a reaction of disappointment, then I knew it wasn't is set up and it was all in my mind you have to be careful with every move that you do that's just how life works you have to be careful with every move that you do i can't go to fucking cape town and think that i run shit in cape town Cape Town has its own bosses. People in Cape Town who run things in Cape Town. You can't just go to Cape Town or go to Durban and think you're the man chilling, relaxing, go to the club, go to the restaurant at night. I'm chilling, I'm hugging people, taking pictures. No, you have to be moving with people. You have to at least have like six, seven people with you at all times. And you have to have protection with you at all times. So if it goes down, then you're ready. That's just how life works. If it why he yelling though? I don't know. Why he like like why you yelling though? I mean, you can just talk to us. You don't gotta yell at niggas. I mean, you got niggas leaving and shit. I mean goes down then you're ready so people are crying and moaning i get it everybody said aka was a superstar one of the biggest superstars that this country has ever seen but at the end of the day he was also careless let's not pretend like he wasn't careless love the brother love this music but he was careless he was moving too reckless he was moving too wild uh we off this man is he yelling she get my head hurt um what's the okay so they said it's another one right let me see if I can find this comment. All right. It says, AKA's killer's real identity revealed as his friend, Big Wawa. That's speaking about it? Big friend, AKA Big friend Wawa speak out for justice as he exposed. Okay. Y'all wanna watch this? You wanna watch this? Yeah, play. Get it. What's up guys, it's your boy Big Wawa back with another video please please guys do not say rest in peace aka he can't rest in peace until we know who's responsible for his murder okay i just want to say beggy tele beggy tele please don't go on screen on our tvs and say this is a high priority case we're gonna investigate we're gonna investigate because every time beggy tele says this is a high priority case we're gonna investigate nothing happens he said that about Senzo Meiwa. He said that about the tavern shootings. He's been saying that about so many murders and so many crimes and nothing ever happens. We don't even want to see Begitele on screen. We don't want to hear anything he has to say. What we want is to lay AKA to rest and give the family time to heal. But the family must enlist the help of 
private security and private investigators so that they can find out who did this to AKA. The promoter must be investigated because you can't just someone without knowing their movements. So we, we want to know the promoter, his cell phone must be seized, his laptop, all electronic devices must be seized. I got a question, why, why the promoter though? And does the promoter know the time he's gonna be there or just the time that he has to be at the club or the, or the venue? That, those are the people we must start by investigating. That, that's the first. That's the first person we must investigate. We can't just say rest in peace, AKA rest in peace, and then next week we move on. Next week someone else dies. Rest in peace, rest. No, not super mega. We loved AKA. We loved AKA. Rest in peace to AKA. He's a beast, he's a problem. We're gonna stay listening to his music for days to come, for years to come. Our kids will know about AKA. All the people who are graffiti artists paint AKA all over the town. You know, we need to honor this man. He was a great man. May his family be strong and may South Africa fight for what's right. We can't take this anymore. People are just saying like it's nothing. And then our, those who we trust to solve the problem, uh, we will investigate, please. We can't take it anymore. Rest in peace, super mega. But he must only rest in peace after we find out who did this, I'm out. You hard with uh, the project, you're welcome. And um, yeah, man, we've been pushing really, really hard. We really thank you for all the support. So uh, just want to let you know how you guys are, just check on you guys, how you guys are doing. I got um, some recording, I got some verses that I got to do. But before that, I've got the jollof rice now. And the Irish potato. And that the goat, the goat meat. Yeah, bro. And the turkey. Your shout out to Jollof Cafe. Mm. It's too much. Mm. Yo, gang, what's the next video we about to watch?